The German military is under-equipped to take on its upcoming role as leader of NATO's anti-Russian defense force. A leaked document shows, opposition politicians say the defense minister is to blame. The German military has secretly admitted that it can't fulfill its promises to NATO, according to documents leaked to Die Welt. The Bundeswehr is due to take over leadership of NATO's multinational Very High Readiness Joint Task Force at the start of next year, but doesn't have enough tanks, the Defense Ministry document said. Specifically, the Bundeswehr's 9th Tank Brigade in Munster only has nine operational Leopard 2 tanks, even though it promised to have 44 ready for the VJTF, and only three of the promised 14 Martyr Armored Infantry vehicles. The paper also revealed the reason for this shortfall. A lack of spare parts and the high cost and time needed to maintain the vehicles. It added that it was also lacking night vision equipment, automatic grenade launchers, winter clothing and body armor. The German Air Force is also struggling to cover its NATO duties. The document revealed the Luftwaffe's main forces, the Eurofighter and Tornado fighter jets and its CH-53 transport helicopters, are only available for use an average of four months a year. The rest of the time the aircraft are grounded for repairs and rearmament. The state for all part-time forces are similarly worrying, Hans Peter Bartels, parliamentary commissioner for the armed forces. Told Die Welt, opposition politicians blame Defense Minister Ursula von der Leyen for allowing the military to deteriorate. Von der Leyen should ask herself what she's been doing for the last legislative period, Green Party defense spokesman Tobias Lindner said in a statement. Apparently it is politically more opportune to constantly announce armament intentions and trend reversals. Rather finally addressing the problems of spare parts and maintenance, von der Leyen is fully and totally responsible for the current problems.